And what's good, everybody? Sounds I'm here back in with another Spider-Man video. Uh, I think I'm binging this this series pretty hard. I'm not sure how often I'm gonna upload this since I haven't even started editing any of the videos yet at this point of me recording. But yeah, guys, we're gonna be getting. I'm gonna be getting on that soon. You guys will know when that's happening. So yeah. But yeah, guys. Uh, in the last video, we did some mess with the mask and a few moments later. Also, we fought Shocker, so that was pretty cool as well, seeing Shocker in the game, seeing his suit developed in the game. And the one thing that it kind of cheeses me in the, the game, or with the game, is like the character design, or the character in general, because both Mary Jane and Peter, they look pretty awkward, because just, just look at that face, alright? Like... That, that looks pretty awkward. Then again, my face looks awkward too. That's why I don't show it. But yeah, guys, if you guys want to see more content like this, make sure to kick that like button and make sure to share this video for your friends. You guys are much a girl. And guys, without further ado, let's do this thing. I think. Yeah, let's leave. Can I leave? Yeah, I can. All right. Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little Spidey workout in the city. I'm getting some pretty nice levels right here. Stop! Oh my gosh. I'm just taking out ra I swear, okay. Okay, I need to stop pressing down on the joystick. Because every time... This is like the second time that's happened. Alright. Alright, so what was I what was I even about to say before I was so rudely interrupted by Peter doing this rock out move? Cause I just took out like five people in that one blast. On me, what's good? Mr. Lee spoke to me. He seemed worried. Are you into something dangerous? Oh, it's just a story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry, I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You've got a good boss, man. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Now that's love right there. That's love. And also, guys, uh, if you guys don't like me wearing the rock out suit or look at that. Half the crime towers back up already. When spider cops on the job, come hell or high water, the job gets Nope, nope, nope. Nope. She'd never admit it, but the chief was warming up to Spider Cop. His casual disregard for by the book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around someday. Like I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted. If you guys don't like the spider punk outfit and you guys want me to go to a different outfit, just leave that in the comments below and we can do whatever you guys, or we can wear whatever suit you guys want me to wear. And yeah, that's here for you guys to deal with. Work with me, dang. All right, there we go, all right. I like when it gives me just free time to do whatever I want so that is pretty nice so you don't constantly be in the story and you can just go around doing the satellites and the backpacks but yeah that's Hello? that is something Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. oh hey what's up Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting I totally forgot I mean I, mean, I didn't forget forget I just I, I'll be there soon <sighs> this tardiness is starting to become a pattern Come on, Parker. You're better than this. That's <sighs> right. How did I lose track of time? No! I'm not sure if I said this already, but the, the fighting combat is fighting and the combat it's very much similar to Batman and all their Arkham Knight games or whatever it's called it's 
really fluid as well. Not fun getting beat up? We'll sit with that for a while. And having the suits have different powers, it's it's pretty interesting. It's a different take on other Spider-Man games, which would have or would be very similar if it wasn't for the Spider-Man powers. I'm not sure if they had that in other games, but I'm pretty sure they didn't. So yeah. And that's another backpack, so I'll go ahead and get that. I'll meet you guys when I make it over to Doc Ock's lab. Ah, there you are. But also, guys, I wanted to show you guys my uh, my skill set because I'm not sure if I showed it yet or showed it. Yeah, it showed it yet because in the video I recorded for the third installment of this, I had to ditch because my dad walked in and you know, guys know I have recording anxiety, so I can't show you that. So we're going to press this and we're going to go to suits. This is where you guys can change the suits. So this is where all that is at. Secret War suit and uh, new mode or suit power called arms race gadgets you can get new gadgets nothing new there nothing new there nothing new there skills and this is all the skills i have i have hazard zone spin cycle wrecking ball and point launch point launch boost quick zip and air tricks and then the four or three basic ones swing kick perfect dodge and web throw so yeah that's what's going on there and we have three extra ones so and that seems pretty good scare tactics generate surprise attack oh yeah that moves gonna be nice all right we can definitely use that Aw, oh, dang, I don't even have enough for it. All right, what could I have done? I could have done throw, yeah. All right, we'll be working on that for the next one. But yeah, guys, those are my skills. But yeah, we're going to make it over to Doc Ock, and I'll see you guys when we make it over there. All right, I'm going to turn my mic off just in case. Hopefully, I remember to put it on so it's not like Detroit Become Human all over again. All right, never mind. There's not even a use for me to turn it off but you know just in case how does it work just like a natural arm you think of what you want it to do and yes <laughs> Hey, hey, what do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> That's tragic. It's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> he 
Easy, easy, easy. They, they, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. I wish I could do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. You should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Harry left me a message about these. I'm going way quicker than I should, because it's hey, too fire. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's going to shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is, too. Well, it's not going to pay the bills, but it sounds like it means a lot to him. Research I'll do tokens. I can to help. So, so now that this is another thing that we have to do, or another completion for the district that we can do. Wait, what? This is another of our air quality stations monitoring containment in the surrounding atmosphere. Super important for the city and its citizens, but certain corporate overlords are less than thrilled by the prospect of their population output being publicly, or publicly reported. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Actually, hold on. I've got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the, oh, what's the word, contaminants before they reach toxic levels. Between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting. The amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high and rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. The particles are concentrating in trouble spots, like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get samples, then trace them to the source. How in the world am I supposed to get all the way up there? The world? Calm down! Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. I can't even do anything. How'd I not get that? Come on, sir. All right, here we go. That should work. Thank you. Visible to the naked eye. The level of toxins must be up there. And gotcha. So, I'm. I'm spending a lot of time doing these while recording or doing these completion whatever you call these so I'm gonna do most of these off recording so I can at least complete it but I'm gonna try to Got it. not do it so much while recording so hopefully you guys won't have to see this or any more of this in my videos so just, just telling you guys oh, feels like I'm breathing from a tailpipe <laughs> Huh. The toxins coming from two types of cars and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. Great light on that one. Dang, that's fire. Oh dang. Perfect. This 
smokestack picture I ever took. The Department of Environmental Protection will take it from here. Maybe I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Well, Harry Station just stopped the public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Stop Shocker at the bank. Spider-Man, Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was, but one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. All right, let's do this. More Shocker, all right. We've got a chance. Here. I've been looking into the demons. Sounds like they've quietly established a power base in the vacuum left by Fisk. A vacuum I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. But what were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman actually, pulled our funding. Oh, Pete. I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some sense into his dad. You'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. Here we go. More shocker. Oh, dang, we're actually over 20 minutes now. All right, we're going to end it in a little bit. Herman, long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Want to play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Dang! Whoa. Your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid. Dang, how do I dodge that? There's no way to dodge him. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who How in the world I can't even do anything now? Also, how would you measure it? Words per minute, syllables per second, or is it more about how many words one uses to express a single thought? It's also subjective. If you ask me, some people don't talk enough. Think about it. There's there's no way to stop him. What? You know what? Nah, no. I'm ending it. I don't even care. Guys, see you in the next video. I spit raps like a heart attack. Fast fatal heart impact. Past painful scars. In fact, I blast tasteful bars and pass.